Can we ask, I think uh, it would be great to have uh, Homera Mansouri, the director of the forum and organization who's actually made it possible for all of us to be here, well, to welcome her on the stage. Homera. Everyone Homera, thank you. Welcome everybody. It's so great to see you all in an almost stuffed conference room in times in which conference rooms are not always stuffed or haven't been stuffed with packed with people for the last two and a half years. And as you can see, I'm wearing my mask all the time and I would like to remind you with the full love in my heart and solidarity that you are obliged to wear the mask while you're sitting in this room because uh, we tried to give as uh, much sitting uh, maximum capacity as possible and uh, that's why you can't keep the distance always and that's why we're really asking you very kindly um, to wear your mask at all times except when you're on stage. So if you've got something to say to everybody, just come on stage and then you can also take off your mask. <laughs> Think about it. <laughs> I'm very, very excited to have you all here. Welcome in Cologne, dear guests. I know that you come from all different parts of this, uh, this globe, and uh, I think it's a great opportunity uh, that you meet here again in very, very difficult times. Um, my name is Humaira, and I'm uh, very happy to welcome you here, and I'm head of the political education sector uh, of uh, Volkshochschule Köln, and this is one of our biggest halls. It's called Forum Volkshochschule. You know what a forum is all about. It's a place where people can come and meet and gather and talk to each other, and that's why we called it Forum. And of course, at the moment, we have a lot of uh, challenges uh, be because we have restrictions. It's very difficult for people to meet and to see each other's faces and to talk and let eyes talk, not just words, and let actions talk. That's why it's even more beautiful that you have all gathered here uh, for today and tomorrow. Um, let me just uh, tell you in a few words what Volkshochschule actually is all about. It's a very um, stubborn German word and not everybody knows what it's all about, but something really miraculous and beautiful is hiding behind it. Volkshochschule is an adult institution for voluntary education, so everybody who comes here to our institution comes on a voluntary basis, which is really cool. And uh, we are part of the city administration of Cologne. And we offer education to everybody. Yes, actually to really everybody. E each single person in the society is invited to take part in our courses and in our program. Everybody, we believe in that, everybody should have, be able to have access to education, to knowledge, to the possibility to exchange opinions and to build new relationships in this society and to create new bonds. And uh, if you are willing to empower yourself, if you are willing to learn new things just for your own personal development or for your job qualifications, education must have a very good quality and it must be affordable and accessible, and that's really what we are trying to do. Um, and uh, this is also what public institutions like ours have been doing for the last 103 years. We had a big, big celebration in 19, uh, 2019 that Volkshochschule um, exists, has been existing since 1919 in Germany. I think it's a very German thing. There are more than 940 of our institutions in the whole country. Even in the smallest region, you will find a Volkshochschule, an institution for adult education. And our Volkshochschule Köln is the third biggest in the whole country. So we see that we also have a big responsibility towards you, towards everybody who is attending our, our courses and projects. We have basic principles upon which our work is based. One essential principle is the promotion of human rights, and that's why you're here today. The promotion of human rights in our municipality and on local ground, as well as in the whole wide world. And as the head of political uh, education, one of my tasks is to explain human rights to the people who come here. I don't have it to explain it to you, but of course we are also talking to people who are not very well informed, but they want to be well informed. So the idea is actually to explain human rights to the people, why they are absolute basic rights, why they are so important and why it is important to fight for them every single day in the whole wide world and for the whole wide world. And all we can do, our share is to give information, to bring people together like today, because you have the information, to be interactive, 
to exchange ideas, discuss social and political issues, and to offer the people a way how to become active themselves in the society. So also to do something like advocacy. And of course, we work with a lot of institutions and initiatives and reach out for each other's hands to awaken the interest in these topics within the society. And that's why I'm so happy that you're all here. You're all fighters for human rights, for the right to be yourselves and for the right of many human beings that we don't know personally. personally. So many of them still don't have a name or a face and you are working on giving them a face and all the rights that we all need and we all deserve so much. So thank you very much for your open minds. Thank you for, um, very much for your actions, for your empowerment and for your work. And I wish you all a very successful gathering with new ideas. I wish you all empowering moments and uh, new fresh strength to go on with your work. And I'm also happy that the deputy mayor of the city of Cologne, Andreas Wolter, who can't be here today, has sent you a video message because he wants to say hi to you and welcome you as, um, let's say, the second highest person in the administration of the city of Cologne, because we feel very honored that you've chosen this place to do the conference. Thank you for your attention. Thank you, Homera. And Thank goodbye. You. Thank you. <laughs> Very much. Thank you very much.